Hello, thank you for joining me. I'm on a Chilton Railways Class 165 and I'm on my way to Oxford. Today we're going to the City of Oxford Model Engineering Society's Railway at Cutler's Low Park. So it's another episode of Miniature Railway Britain. I'm going to be getting off at Oxford Parkway, which is fairly new. It opened in October 2015, because from there it's a shorter walk to Cutler's Low Park than if I was to get off at the main Oxford Railway Station. So we're still very much in the countryside, as you can see. Just see the Banbury Road, just see the Banbury Road Stone Terminal. Next station is Oxford. Drivers just let us know that the next station is Oxford Parkway, so that's where we're going to get off. And then I've got a walk, um, it's not too far, it's about half a mile, three quarters of a mile walk from the railway station to the park. So I've never been to this railway before, so I'm really quite excited about this. It's a new railway for me. And um, I've been to Oxford many times before, but just never been to this railway. It's right in the northern suburb, so that's why I'm getting off here rather than the main Oxford station. So. We're just pulling into Oxford Parkway now, so I'll show you that. I will obviously have to stop filming to get my ticket out for the ticket barriers. Then I'll walk and um, we sh I'll show you as we arrive at Oxford Parkway. I mean, sorry, at the railway. So we're arriving at Oxford Parkway now. So let's get off the train. And here we go. So I'm on a class 165, it's 165033. I saw the number of this one when I came in. Not sure what the unit on the back is, but I'll see that as we go out. I'll just let you have a look at the station as we before we leave. Oh, here we are, Oxford Parkway. Mm. Tell we're in the Cotswolds and now the Cotswold stone of the bridge. There's our, our train we've just come on. So for a while, when they reopened this stretch of track, this was the terminus for the Chilton Railways trains going to Oxford. And then they finally extended the last bit down into Oxford. So let's just watch the train go. on the back. So, let's go and visit the Miniature Railway at Cutler's Low Park. I've now been walking for about 20-25 minutes, so probably about a mile, three quarters of a mile. I am from Oxford Parkway now. I'm now walking through this rather pleasant, rather quiet residential area in the northern suburbs of Oxford. But just up here, the residential area ends and the park begins. So I've never seen this railway before, so I am literally recording this as I arrive. So um, this is going to be interesting. I don't even know when I get into the park which direction, but I have a feeling it's going to be in that direction. So ooh, it looks quite busy. There's a lot of cars here. Um, so obviously if you don't want to do what I did and come here by train, you could drive here. So that's also an option, but um, I do try and go to as many minutes rail as I can by train, but sometimes it's nice to drive there, especially if I take my larder. Oh, there's a map there. Um, so we're here. Oh, it says Miniature Railway, I can see it. So not too far now. Um, what I'm gonna do, I've shown you the arrival at the park. I think it's gonna be a few minutes walk down there, so I'm gonna keep walking and I'll show you when we get there. So I've just come down this drive and I can now see the Minute Railway over there. So it's quite a big queue, so what I'm going to do, I'll walk around and have a look at the train first um, and then I'll go and queue up and have my ride. So, as I said, very excited about this, not been here before. Um, oh, I can hear the whistle of the steam logo, so that's a very promising sound. There's the countryside out over there, so you can see we really are on the very northern edge of Oxford. Um, it would, you could walk to the city centre, I probably will, because I was going to get a train back later on from the main Oxford railway station. But I thought I'd come this way for a bit of fun. I can just see, I don't know if the camera's going to pick it out, but I can just see a cloud of steam as a steam train disappears off in the distance. So, um, let's see what we can find. Well, I've never seen such a big queue for a minute. 
future that way. So it goes right the way around there, so it's just going to be interesting. This double headed train, there's two, um, two quarry hunters that's about to depart. So, what I think I'm going to do is walk up here and um, watch them go. So, I can see at least three locos in steam. So, this is really, really quite exciting. I think the train's going to come. Let's watch this train go by. I'm going to go and join the queue and have my ride. Why? <laughs> 
Well, I've had a great afternoon here at Cutler's Low Park. Um, really enjoyed r riding behind the four steam locomotives. Very North Wales feeling here today in Oxford, because um, on that train we had the Quarry Hunslet and we had Charles, which um, is a miniature version of Linda from the Fastiniog Railway. And then we also had a miniature number seven, Tom Rolt from the Tallaghlin Railway, along with another narrow gauge loco. So it's really had that very North Wales feel here today. Um, as you can see, this is the seven and a quarter and five inch gauge railway. This is a head shunt this side in here, which is only seven and a quarter inch. It's to get trains into the carriage shed. So um, you can see a train would have to reverse over these points up to the head shunt and then the racetrack line here swings out the way and then you've got the tracks going around there into the carriage shed. I knew the racetrack railway wasn't going to be running today so um, I wasn't expecting to have a ride but at some point we'll come back in the future and um, we'll do the racetrack railway. Um, as for the society themselves, they've been around for quite a long time. They started in 1955. They used to be at Blenheim Palace and um, they had a railway there. They left Blenheim Palace in 1988. I'll put um, a picture in now. That's a headboard of the last train that ran in Blenheim Palace. And they came here in the late 80s and then last year they built this extension here out into the park. You can just see the Quarry Hunslet and um, Charles out on that extension now. So this was only open last year, this extension, which takes the line round there. So it previously the ground level tracks went round here and as I said we've got the race track in the middle. So it's a really, really nice railway. You can get here by train or you can drive it. It took me, like I said, about half an hour to walk from Oxford Parkway. I'm going to walk back to Oxford Station just for the fun of it, which I know is going to take me longer than it did um, from Oxford Parkway, but it's, it's accessible by public transport and if you don't fancy the walk you can get a bus here. So it's, it's a really, really nice railway, it's in a very nice park, so you know why not come and visit the railway at Cutler's Low Park. I've had a great time, so um, thank you very much for watching. Please do feel free to like, subscribe and comment. And from the Cutlers of the Hope Park Railway, goodbye.